Hey guys, it's your girl Sana, aka Stacey, and I'm back with another video! Yep, I'm back with another video. This video is gonna be a full face drugstore beat makeup. Yes, I said it. Drugstore makeup, yep. Got all of this. Looking flawless. Looking like a million bucks. No, I'm just playing. I don't like a million bucks, but I'm looking good though. And this is all drugstore. So if you wanna see how I got this, makeup then just keep on watching also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and yeah let's just get into the video okay as you can see my eyebrows is already done now i'm gonna start off with the color pop no filter concealer in the color deep golden 16. once i'm finished with that i'm gonna use the fit me loose finish powder so i can set my concealer Today's palette is going to be the City Mini Time Shayla palette and this is also from uh, Maybelline. Super affordable, super affordable. It has about six shades in it and all lovely colors. You can use it for daytime, nighttime, anytime you want. Shayla, you did that. You really did that. So I'm going to be going in the color, um, that brown color in there. I'm going to be adding that to my, um, as my transition shade using windshield wiper motions I'm just adding a little bit more because I felt like it was not showing up now I'm going to be using that black shade I'm going to be using that on my outer V so I'm just going to add that so it can make it like you know I didn't know what kind of look I was doing, but I knew I needed something to do with that brown and that black. So, I'm just adding that to the outer V. Next, I'm going to be putting the ColourPop um, filter concealer on the um, in the middle there. So I'm just gonna just clean it out a little bit so once I put my eyeshadow it can pop. I'm gonna be using this glitter primer over here. This one is the NYX glitter primer. Glitter primer. Ooh, that burgundy comes out. See how it comes out? Comes out really nice. Yes, girl, yes. Now I'm adding that little a little bit of gold in the middle just to make it just to make my look look perfect. And then I'm gonna use my um Colasto Big Shot Mascara. Um this is also from Maybelline. As you can tell, I love Maybelline products and I'm gonna be using this baby skin instant pour eraser also for Maybelline and I like this primer a lot because it um, covers my pores a little bit I know I have a lot of pores but it, sh it covers it it covers it up for the most part it also reminds me of the um, benefit um, pore professional now I'm using the fit me foundation in the color 355 coconut I love this foundation I've been using this foundation ever since I first started doing makeup and it never fails it does good now I'm using this um, Real Techniques um, Expert Face Brush and I'm just going to dab, dab, dab and blend it really good. Adding a little bit more foundation so it can look more, a little bit more full, full coverage because it was not really looking that full in my liking, so I had to like add a little bit more. Now I'm gonna be using this um I'm gonna be using this um big fat body sponge from Real Techniques. I really love that they made this body sponge because nobody's gonna be using it for their body. Well I use it on my face because it like blends out my makeup in like 2.5 seconds. Look at this. Look how fast it is. And I'm all done. Now I'm gonna go back to my ColourPop No Filter Concealer. 
and I'm just gonna add that um, to the um, under my eyes, the bridge of my nose, a little bit of my forehead, and then my cupid's bow. Going back in with my Real Techniques brush, I'm gonna just blend, 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 blend. Now I'm going in with a little Real Technique sponge and I'm just gonna blend in the middle part and then just go a little bit under my eyes. Now I'm going back to my Fit Me Loose um, Finish Powder and I'm just gonna set my um, under eye because I am an oily girl and I just don't want to be looking like a frying pan once I'm finished. Even though I'm not going out. but And I love this brush. This brush is so good. It's from Lux Cosmetics. And it's the um, 660 brush, the Precision Foundation. And I like to use it under my eyes because it comes out flawless. Now I'm using this LA Girl Pro Contour Powder. This is in the color Deep. I'm using that on the sides of my cheeks and I'm gonna use it on my forehead to give it a little bit more dimension and I used to use the um, NYX one but it all got finished so I never went back to go buy a new one so when I see the Elegero one I just tried it now I'm using this big um, Royal and Nickel brush it's a foundation brush. I'm just using it to clean up all the um, powder that I put in my face and just making sure everything looks good. Now I'm going back in at the Color Girl Pro um, Contour Powder just to like add it to my nose. I know I'm not using the right brush, but I couldn't find it so at the time. So I just said, you know what, let me just grab any brush and just try to make a line down my nose. You know it didn't come out that good, but I tried. I'm going back in with that ColourPop No Filter Concealer to add that back in so I can make it look good again. Now I'm going in with this black liner I got from the dollar store when I was in New York. And I love it. I use it all the time. I don't know which name brand it's from, but nice fat black eyeliner. Now I'm going back into that palette and using that brown shade to put it under my eyes. Then I'm going to go in with the um, powder. This is the um, Fit Me um, Matte and Poreless Powder. So everything can look good. So I'm just using my big fluffy brush and just putting that all over my face. Now I'm going back in with that Maybelline um, Colostal Big Strap Mascara. I'm going to put that on my lower lashes. Now I'm using the e.l.f. blush, I'm going to put those in my cheek, using the um, Real Techniques blush brush. Last but not least, I'm going to be using the Master Chrome highlighter, also from Maybelline. Well, this is the last item I'm using from Maybelline. As you can see, this highlighter is everything. If you know me, you know I love highlight. So, yes, honey, yes. Putting some on my nose, on the top of my forehead a little bit, and in my cupid's bow. Now to set everything in place, I'm gonna be using my NYX Matte Finish Spray. This is long lasting and ugh, feels so good. And it keeps my face matte. Now I'm back, I change. I put my scarf on and I'm using this NYX Ombre Lip Duel. Oh my god, I love this so much. I don't know why they discontinued it. This was like the best thing that NYX ever came out with. And now they're gone. Um, and this is in the color Cookies and Cream. I love this so much, but I'm still going to use it until I finish with this one. 
and good thing I had like three of them but um to top it off I put this elf lip lip gloss oh my god this lip gloss is like a dollar or two dollars but it's popping now let me get into my slow mos I hope you like this video give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel we're gonna continue doing these videos I'm gonna be giving it to you left and right and until next time bye guys